Uh, let's go. All right, let's go. <laughs> what country has the most beautiful women? They always say Ukraine. Since K content have become really popular worldwide, are there a lot of people in Ukraine like they like K-pop too? So, collective K-pop, who is married to Mr. Bota, who is with Nagradita, Grante, Grante. Lots of people are always working, busy, but in Ukraine we like to just kind of have fun or silly or anything. <laughs> I, I'm bad. Я хочу просто побажати людям, що вони не хворі. Hi, I'm Emily from Canada. Hi, I'm Nika. I'm from Ukraine. Hi, my name is Stefan, and I'm from Korea. Last time we met, we ate some really delicious Ukrainian food, and we had met these really beautiful, nice people. So let's go walk around the DDP now and see if we can learn a little bit more about Ukraine and how these people are dealing with being in Korea. Let's go. All right, let's go. <laughs> Did you guys know that this used to be a stadium? No. It I'm... was like a really famous stadium. I don't know all the details. Don't come for me in the comments. But but uh, it used to be a stadium and then uh, the government, like it got too old or something and then the government decided to turn it into this. So now it's used for like... It's a museum yeah. as far as I know. That's right. And then the government said that they wanted to turn it into this. I know. She's like, I already I knew that. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you do for work? I'm working dancer. Artist in Lotte World Park. Oh, it's really so like fun. Is it really fun? It's really fun. Oh. No, no, I I like it, but a uh, little bit tired. Oh, sure, sure. But this is so funny job. Oh, well, and you've got that young girl energy, so you can handle it. Yeah. <laughs> so did you start dancing when you were younger then? Uh, I'm start dancing five years. Since you were five? Mm. Wow. I did too, but I sucked. <laughs> so my mom was like, yeah, we're not going to keep doing that. <laughs> you don't have no rhythm. Oh, what's that? Why do they have the dancing guys? Maybe it's like a New Year's decoration kind of? Fun. It's like this. <laughs> Ooh. We should stand in front of it. Oh, stand in front this of it. Way. Stand in front of it. Uh. <laughs> I, I'm bad at this. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you feel is like the biggest difference between living here and living in Ukraine? Probably like culture mentality because Korea is much much more different than Ukraine. Uh, for example, uh, Korea is a very fast-paced uh, yeah. country, lots of people are always working, busy. In Ukraine it's kind of like that but a little less and uh, people are like more relaxed and don't hurry as much. I'm always busy, 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 yeah, always yeah. doing something, you know. Like in Ukraine, I could call my friend and be like, oh, let's go have dinner. And then they'll be like, okay, let's go. Here in Korea, you have to like plan like maybe a week <laughs> ahead of time. So like, you know, it's kind of like those kind of differences. But it's pretty exciting here in terms of like, stuff to do like there's so much stuff to do i i very i don't think since i've lived here i've felt bored once there are many things to do in korea as far as like creative places where you can go and yeah. have fun in ukraine we have a lot of fun places but it's more just like nature we like walking in ukraine you know it's like a nice view maybe some cafe or you know and ha like just walk and talk in korea they like to like do something somewhere or like go to a cafe yeah yeah, yeah. but in ukraine we like to just kind of have fun just walking around doing something fun or silly or anything what is this i've seen this a couple times when i've been here and i read about it and then i forgot immediately what it was of course kind of old houses uh, remain what do you think the Ukrainian image of Korea is? No, yeah, uh, image типа для українців про корейців, типа, ну, що взагалі думають? Що корейці дуже багато працюють. То що вони як живуть на роботі, тобто, якщо в нас в Україні, тобто ти працюєш там з 9 до 6, там до 5, то ти у 6 годин все тобі От, от тебе вже нема в офісі, ти вже пішов, а корейці більш вони люблять е, переробляти, тобто залишатися на роботі, ще щось, е, да, да, овертайми якісь, тобто вони більш такі роботяги. Да, да, да. Work-life balance is yeah. different there than here. 
І ще одне те, що корейці дуже помішані на зовнішності. Ah, uh, saying that uh, Ukrainian people think that Korean people uh, tend to look at too much a huge focus to the appearance of people. Mm-hmm. Like obviously trends of like, you know, you have to look beautiful, blah blah, beauty standards are crazy here. Even like work stuff like they would uh, hire you if you were pretty, but if you are not then probably they won't, you know, that kind of stuff. Like, because obviously you have a lot of idols here. You have a lot of, you know, famous people that do like plastic sh- uh, surgery and all that stuff. So uh, they just put too much emphasis on, you know, beauty. <laughs> Since K contents have become really popular worldwide, are there a lot of people in Ukraine like who are consuming K contents now? Like, I mean, K dramas, K pop. Yeah. It's interesting. There are many people So she's saying for the past couple of years now, uh, K-pop, K-dramas have become very popular even in Ukraine. K-pop, when it comes to like, you know, famous groups like BTS, Blackpink, you know, Stray Kids, all those people, they have a huge influence, of course, on the younger generation of Ukrainians where dancers, for example, like herself, they use Korean dance routines for their like covers and everything. And so it influences a lot of like the pop culture even in Ukraine. So right now it's uh it's getting bigger and bigger so. Mm, навіть змагання вже є з кіпоп танців, які колективи кіпоп, які змагаються між собою та вигравують награди та гранти, гранти, щоб приїхати до Кореї. Wow, that's really cool. So like now that Korean men because of BTS and other idols, now Korean men have like risen up into this very esteemed position amongst women, so my question is, are you getting more kwanjim now from girls back oh, home? Oh, back home. Uh, yes, I would say I would say that uh, because when I lived in Ukraine, like obviously it gives me a higher chance of like meeting someone there, like dating and things like that. So yeah, yeah lots of friends of mine, uh, they are into K-pop yeah. and they love the fact that they have a Korean friend like me yeah. uh, or even like, you know, the girls that I've dated, like they like K-pop too. Yeah. So obviously that helped influence their decisions. So yeah. yeah, I think so. So it's helping you out. <laughs> I guess. I mean, I don't know, but, <laughs> but what about, do you, do you like Korean guys? Uh, yeah. Дивуються, лякаються і обходять. She's also saying that sometimes it's really strange where her and her friend would be walking, like also a foreign friend, handsome like Korean men would be surprised to see him. And then also like they're looking at him as if they're interested, but then right away they just kind of walk past. So it's like they're not like trying anything. So like it's kind of weird for her. They're like <laughs> They're shy. They're shy. <laughs> shy stay away from them <laughs> the ones that are shy are the better ones <laughs> I don't know if you've probably heard this many times but Korean men if you ask them what country has the most beautiful women <laughs> they always say Ukraine yeah so what do you think about that you're like yeah that's right <laughs> she thinks that uh, Korean men like natural beauty more so like that's why in uh, y- Ukrainian girls like they could be without makeup or anything. As far as like natural beauty goes, like that's why she thinks that you know obviously Ukraine is very popular amongst uh, Korean oh, men. Oh, like natural beauty is. Tigam han den hengsa inga ba. Ah, kisi se benza das katori. Giant step mile, digit. I think it's a digital light show or something. Ah, yeah, because they have a lot of light shows here and stuff. Oh, so. Oh, uh, he. Right here? Yeah, they have like a projector that lights up this uh, this part of the building. Oh. And like even yesterday they had like a Christmas show here. Oh, Korea? Oh, why get that? Oh, and the last one is that one? That one because it's New Year's Eve. Ah, that's why. New Year's Eve like in Korea is kind of different than for me in Canada. In Canada it's like huge party, you go get drinking. Okay, into and you're going to the same, yeah. So this, uh, when, and like the countdown, like 10, 9, 8, Google has sale. Yeah, 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 yeah. Then, this place is good. Ah, why? 
Чоги и хат моя не сосо. Я там робила фоточку. Мне кто ж робив там фоточку. She's saying she likes that too because she took a picture there, and I was the one that took a picture. Okay, before we go, New Year's resolution. What's your New Year's resolution? Oh, let me think. Do you have a New Year's resolution? Типа які обіцянки типа на новий рік? Я вже виповнила одну ціль – це приїхати до Кореї. Я дуже щаслива, що я тут, і я сподіваюся, що я ще тут залишусь на деякий час. Я хочу просто побажати людям, щоб вони не хворіли, не сварилися зі своїми близькими та підтримували один одного, бо зараз непрості часи. І щоб люди не сварилися і жили в мирі. Це єдине моє таке прохання до нового, до нового року та усіх людей, щоб усе було мирно, люди не страждали, не вмирали. Okay. То все було гаразд у, у кожній домівці. So basically one of her dreams was obviously to come to Korea. And so obviously she was able to do this. And so uh, for her, her first dream was like, you know, already accomplished. But then the second thing is she just wishes uh, something very simple where people lived in peace, people didn't argue, fight, and everybody just lived very happily, you know? <laughs> exactly. And so that's basically her I love wish. that. Such a nice girl. <laughs> what about you? Uh, I think for me is uh, I just want to go back to Ukraine. Hopefully, like because as a Korean citizen, I can't legally go there right now. But hopefully, something changes so that I could go back and see my friends because obviously I haven't seen them in two years, so I miss them a lot. So that an opportunity opens up for me to go back to Ukraine. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I want. Oh, I so. hope that happens. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for walking around with me. It was so nice to meet you today. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> again, sometime, let's do something again. We can yeah, go sure. eat some Korean food next time. For sure. Awesome. All right, guys. Well, let's go. It's cold. Yeah. I want to go home. <laughs> All right. Okay, guys. Have a good day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Good luck to you. All right, let's all together say good luck to you. Okay, so I'll say three, two, one. Good luck to you. Good luck to you. No, good luck to you. And then let's make a heart around her like this. Ah, okay. And you go like this. No, 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 no. Stop it. Yeah, I'm doing it like this. And you, like, with your heart, do it. Okay, okay. Good luck to you. Woo! 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 Woo!